One of the greatest values in scripture and in the heart of God is life. But how do you really live life in a way in which you're really living? Well, here's something that we value as a church. We live to serve. Let me read again from God's word, if I can. First Peter chapter four, Peter writes this. God has given each of you a gift from his great variety of spiritual gifts. So use them well to serve one another. Do you think you have the gift of speaking? Then speak as though God himself were speaking through you. Do you have the gift of helping others? Do it with all the strength and energy that God supplies. Then everything you do will bring glory to God through Christ Jesus and all glory and power to him forever and ever, amen. You see, Peter writes, every single one of us have been gifted by God to serve others. But see, here's how the enemy messes things up. God has given you a gift. I don't know what that is, but maybe you do. It's a good thing, the gift that God's given you. But don't ever let a good thing become a God thing. See, God is the one that's good and he gives us things and when they're used in the proper place to serve others, they stay good. But when you take a good thing and make it a God thing, that good thing robs you of what's really good, the presence of God and the gifts of God. The gifts are given to serve others, not ourselves. So we as a church, we value living to serve. Not only is serving right, but it's the best way to live life.